Hello everybody, what is going on? We are back on the water. It is that time of year. The spawn is on. The heat is among us. Uh, we've had many, many, many warm days in a row. So I have a good feeling that there will be some bedding bass or some staging bass for sure. Uh, we are on the San Marcos River. The Guad has not had, we've had like no rain over the last six months. So uh, it looks like it would be kind of a miserable throw, ugh, miserable float. Um, so we're doing about five, six miles. We actually did this stretch and Brayman caught a giant bass. Uh, I'll link the video up here. Pretty funny to catch. He had like a bunch of junk on his lure and he was like trying to clear it. Brayman brought the baby rod again. Fingers crossed we get into some big ones today. We have been out uh, three or four times before this and skunk. We went out to Choke Canyon. We were on the water for like 10 hours. It was super windy, didn't catch anything. And then we went to the uh, Come and Take It paddling trail out in Gonzales, didn't catch anything. That was an interesting trip. It was a uh, log jam after log jam. Gonna go down this beautiful section of river, trying to get in some bucket mouse and get you guys thrown back on the GoPro. Stay tuned. Come on. Oh shit, dude. <laughs> what did he hit? Uh, the net roof. Nice, dude. I gotta keep track of my PB on the kitty rod. It's like right over 16 inches. Say 16 inches. That's awesome. That was a good fight. Way to break a two skunk, uh... Two skunk trip? Yeah. It's a good thing you brought the kid, Rod. Yeah. Hey, I got a tiny one. That one? Nice. Drop shot? Yep. First bass in like two months or something. I got one. <laughs> a sneaky little suspicion there'd be a guad in there. Come on, guys. Hey, man. You guys speed running the river? Yes, sir. <laughs> speed is a little bit of a question, yeah. but we're trying. You guys are doing pretty good. What you got, bro? Uh, a looks like a, a big boy. Stop moving. Stop. Nice. Looks like oh, a little... oh, dude, you like that kayak? That's the one I was looking to buy, dude. Buy it. Yeah, okay. They're legit. 127? Yes, sir. Yeah, Good luck, guys. Thanks, y'all have a good one. Yeah, y'all have a good one. Little guadi poo, Brayman. Oh, nice. Oh, here's a, here's a bass right here. Let's see if we can get him to bite. Come on, see it. Yeah, I got him. <laughs> yeah. Oh, I can see him. Oh, he went back up to his bed.
here's a bat. This one looks like it's bedding. Yep, got him. This is a good one. They are for sure betting. This is a male. What? I think this is a male. He's really skinny. Can you put him back on his bed? Do you know where his bed is? Yeah, it's right, right on this tree. I can see it, just the lateral line moving. I wonder if we could set the camera on his bed and then release it. We will put you back where you came from, friend. I hate to disturb whatever you were doing. Long, skinny, weird fish. How big is he? 15 and a quarter. Nice. He's got like a real humpback. Oh yeah. Let's see, the guy's name Quasimodo. <laughs> so this is where... Yeah, yeah, that's why I thought he was a lot bigger. Put him back on his bed. Oh yeah, got him. Okay, good one. No. It's just... He's not bad, but... Not bad. Oh, he did a little show for me. First small mouth of the trip, I think. Got the old red brown eye. Oh, oh my god, so much sweat just got in my eyes. Oh, that hurts so bad. Turn my camera on too. Oh, he's good. I might, might need a net job. Ah. Damn, he's just real skinny. Eh. He's this. Nice. A 14er. 14 on the way back in. No, not yet. It's kind of hard to put something else on a, you know. Yeah. I, you know, go with what you're confident with, and the jig would have been one of the ones. Something big blew up back in there, dude. You see one? No, back in there, something blew up. Like, deep in there, behind that tree.
tiny one. Oh, what did you get caught on? We got about a thousand tubers on the river today. It's uh, because Rio Vista's closed. I guess they're not doing Lions Club. So everyone's floating Dons today. We just found someone's tube sitting in the middle of the river. Oh, sweet, yeah. We'll just throw it up. We just don't want to leave it on the river. Uh, luck? Yeah, early before all the tubers got on. Are we all still going? Yeah. Thank you, thank you. Uh, yeah, when, when you go uh, size on rod, does it go kitty then ultralight or is it ultralight then kitty? That's a question for the folks at home. Is kitty more ultralight than ultralight? I thought I was, I think I'm on. I think I got a little one on. Yeah. Oh yeah, for, uh, probably more than that. I, I don't, yeah, I don't know how it is probably, those tungstens are expensive. Yeah, I might be on, but my line's tangled somehow. Yeah, it's a fish. About the same size. Give me a little guy. Just throw them back on a lure and then just throw them back out. There must be a school of them. It's like the same one I caught. <laughs> Oh, I'm on. Oh, I lost him. No. Oh shit, I didn't I didn't know I was on. <laughs> Brayman breaks the ice. I catch them all during the afternoon and now he's smoking me. Another successful trip in the books. Super happy that spring has sprung and the fish are chewing. Uh, fall and spring is obviously, I think, everyone's favorite time to fish. That's when the fish are chowing. Uh, it's good to see the, the trees and everything else coming back to life.
And Brayman got on another slab with his little baby rod. He really loves to, to chuck that, that kitty set up. It's, I think it's more ultralight than ultralight. But good day on the water. Can't complain any day the sun's out. We're catching fish. Um, hopefully Rio Vista will open back up soon so those lower sections of the San Marcos won't have so much traffic. We noticed that early in the morning and late in the evening was when the bite window really opened up. You know, got past all the tubers and things got good again. But have a few more trips lined up. We got a kayak camping trip lined up for my buddy's birthday. So if you, uh, if you don't want to miss out on that one, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. And we'll see you all in the next one. Peace.